Beneath the veneer of everyday existence lies the secret of human destiny. Gnostics were really mystics. The Gnostics followed the deeper and more advanced side of Jesus' teachings. Jesus had a, a public teaching and a secret teaching. The Christian Gnostics could understand the deeper significance. So many Gnostic texts were outlawed and lost. These texts unveil a hidden side to Jesus' teachings. The Gnostics persisted because there are always individuals that are seeking enlightenment. And when people have that longing, they seek for knowledge, they seek for the truth. The only thing that was known about the Gnostics was what was written by those people persecuting them. So we can use the same techniques that the early Gnostics used, the same techniques that Jesus taught today. When John talks about having visions and visiting angels, the modern Gnostics can understand how it is that John has these kinds of vision. We can explore what exists beyond our physical body, and there's much to existence beyond our physical body. Just as angels have appeared in people's dreams providing guidance in the Bible, we too can gain insight and teachings from our own dreams. By understanding ourselves, we start the process of liberation, we start the process of change. So to understand why the world is the way it is and how to change that, we first need to understand how it is that we work inside. We can transform ourselves into something much more spiritual. Throughout all of history, people seeking that gnosis, that spiritual knowledge, have always used these same simple techniques. <laughs>